welcome back to the channel guys so in this episode we will be covering broken link hijacking so this is a, a bit tricky vulnerability so you have to find all the embedded social media links in our web application in uh, multiple endpoints for example uh, suppose you receive a forget password or forget username email or confirmation email the social media links present in that particular email or uh, the ones which are present at the end of the uh, uh, website for example uh, this is a social media link you can see that this is a facebook link and it is redirecting to the to a high bone where facebook page uh, similarly we can uh, find this one is uh, high where youtube and uh, it is redirecting in the same manner so we have to find all the uh, social media links in a uh, web application in multiple pages and or and in multiple endpoints as well. So if uh, some if any of the link uh, is not redirecting to the uh, to the assigned uh, Facebook or social media page, then we can uh, create the create a similar uh, account or a similar web uh, similar social media page with the same name and we can hijack that particular link to uh, to be clear what i'm uh, talking about let's just uh, um, register a fresh account and let's copy our uh, email address and this is let's ransom to Set a password. Okay, so we are good to go, and we can see that we have uh, received a verification email, and this is the verification email. So, so we can see that this is the verification email, and these are the social media links. So, uh, this is the Twitter link. So ideally, this should redirect us to the Twitter page or Twitter account of the HiveOS or HiveOS application. This is the Discord link, and this is the YouTube link, and this is the Facebook link. So uh, we can see that this is the Twitter link, and we have been redirected to the HiveOS uh, Twitter account. Similarly, this is the uh, Discord server of HiveOS. This is the YouTube channel of HiveOS, and when we move to Facebook, we can see that there is something fishy and it is saying that HiveOS has been hacked by Google. So, what happened here is that uh, the Facebook link from the confirmation email was redirecting the user to a, a page which did not exist. So, uh, to be precise what I am talking about, uh, let's see Facebook page not found and uh, okay and uh, we we the user uh, was redirected to a page something like this so you can see that the page wasn't available but we have the uh, as we have the link of the social media uh, profile we can create a page using that name. See, this is the name of the page which uh, was present in the temp, uh, confirmation email, and we have just created a, a Facebook page with this particular name. So, what happens is well, all the users will be redirected to our Facebook page instead of the targets uh, Facebook or any other social media page. So. This vulnerability comes under uh, P4 category under uh, Workcloud VRT, but uh, it's uh, pretty fun to uh, find it and create a POC on it. As uh, you have to create some pages and you can uh, tweak the page according to you. Like uh, as this particular uh, broken link was hijacked by Werewolf and uh, he uploaded the image as well. So yeah it's pretty fun and uh, it's pretty easy as well but you have to dive uh, a little bit because 
on the home page uh, most probably you will not uh, find this kind of vulnerability as the home page or the important pages are always uh, audited or are always maintained properly but uh, the ones uh, which are not uh, uh, not maintained properly or the ones which are not so important uh, might have this kind of vulnerability and uh, you can find them so yeah that's pretty much it for this video i hope i see you in the next video and bye bye till then